big. This is a huge tank. Hmm. Seem too heavy, but this is big. So when you lay it down, it's the heavy part. Super heavy, but like it's heavy, but definitely have been handling it. Okay, so I want it to kind of be over here. I don't want rolling too much in my car. Oh, it's a huge tank. I got about two bucks in bottles so far, so it's okay. Let me put this bottles here. And then I could jam maybe one. Okay. It's probably, I would say, I don't know, 200 pounds, 250 maybe? 200 pounds probably. It's not killer heavy, but it's raining really hard. So it took me an hour just to get to this location here. I almost thought like it was gone, but then I figured, you know, it's in this area somewhere. So we're gonna cruise another area. Um, this area, like I say, I done yesterday. But I did find one dead end street where I didn't find yesterday, and I found, I don't know, maybe like two bucks in bottles. Mostly wine bottles and some other stuff. Okay, so we'll continue. Stay tuned. Okay, I'm gonna put uh, lock this chair in here. This is light. Let's lean forward here. Oh, he smokes. Doesn't move now. I'm not sure of this area here, I don't see anything around here. It looks like the garbage has been taken away already too. Which is weird. I don't know what the hell that is. It's like a package or something. Exactly what it is. Hmm, not even sure. Like there might be coffee, coffee things or something. I don't know. Well, it's a pretty heavy little pan. There. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep going north the chances they may have uh i'll have to look at the map a little bit better detail but i was south of the 33rd now i'm north of 33rd so all cans have been opened i'm not really sure know what's going on here everything's been dumped a bunch of garbage there okay hold on Oh, pressure washer right there. I'll take that. Pressure washer. It's got good weight, you know. Good copper mortars. Chair went flying already. Some musical chairs. There. Everything's so muddy. Okay, a couple of helium bottles here. Wedge, 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 wedge
Not getting very many bottles, but I'm kind of in and out of the area. That's a problem. The area is kind of in and out. But whatever. I don't hunt here, to be honest, for scrap metal. But uh, so you know, maybe we get the odd thing here that's been sitting for a while. But so far, very little metal here. This is all a super rich area. Well, it's just a rich area, but it's not like super rich. It's just a very expensive homes here. Three million dollars plus. You know, the ones that are fully rebuilt and everything are like five, five, six, seven million dollars probably. It's crazy, yeah, but it is what it is. Okay. Um, the high end pot set. Heavy, heavy aluminum. Oh, 10 pounds of material here. Wow, it's heavy stuff. Oof. Wow, it's heavy. Nice, it's so heavy. Looks like a steel bottom. Yeah, it's a little bit dirty. So, um, yeah, they'd be all dirty. Probably 10 pounds dirty. It's actually really heavy. So, like I say, you know, that's 350, one shot. At least 10 pounds there. Okay. It's actually a heavy rack rack of some sort but not flimsy heavy so I think that's the zone is this way from where I am should part start picking up here the kids bike here could be aluminum let me just put the electric in the back Make the aluminum. No steel, but price is right. So, like I say, there is stuff out here. Like I say, I don't want to go here. I haven't been. I don't hunt this area unless I'm driving a job or something through here. But I, I never, I never check here at all. So, just getting some things. I like to find them. Bag after bag. So, that's how nice they were to put the bags out for people. I believe. I think this one is here. Kabucha. Bag. Not many bags out there, but I'll take them right. Yeah, this area is not that great, but uh, it's wrong, maybe wrong time of year. Who knows? I don't know. Is that a microwave sitting there? No, it's the box. Okay, let's get my bag here. Ooh. Good bottles. Well, most, most of them are about this one here, but so we are getting stuff, but uh, not like yesterday, but oh well. Yeah. There's all sorts of bottles mixed in everywhere. All our tank was good because that's paid for my gas out here. Anyways, whatever else, right? Another bag of bottles. That's why I like them. More bottles there. Nope. Okay. 
bunch of shelf in here. Should be a pretty good load. Oh. Yep. Broke a couple. So once from Mexico broke. She eat burritos. Some lights here. All the junk. Inside here, no. Nope. Well, that's good. Okay. Just caught him right here. He's gonna turn in there, and I see him. He's picking up bottles. It's got a competition here. He's the only person doing it here. So I'm not sure if he came this way or this, he may work this whole area here. Possible. So I think they've been raided here. Well, there's some to me I I grab the big balls, I don't care. Like this one here. Maybe he's coming around this way, who knows? I don't even know what these ones are. If they're even worth anything. As long as you're not soup, soup mix, then you're okay. Let's just say there is competition, but it, you know, that's the way it goes, right? If you say people are the ball guys aren't out right now, oh, I'm all slight, I'll slip down. Okay, I'll have to do the window next time. See, maybe he might not pick this type, type of stuff up. You might be started, starting that street coming this way. I just don't know. Okay, oh yeah, I think that's him there. Yeah, I think it is. Look at how it's just coming this way. Oops. That's his van. So that's a van. Yeah, no, it's not him. He had a van doing Toyota or something. Oh, full yeah. of bottles, Asian guy. Van is full of bottles. 
he's a duck he does vacuum duck cleaning he does bottles look at that the whole top the front of this van is full full of bottles and that's a big van too so he's probably walking and then he's loading them because here if you look at here there's no everything's in front of the house here which is kind of lousy there's no alleys here well so far and this that i've seen so far I mean, they may start now i think they're starting now with some alleys but there there's no alleys at all for a long time that's the third person with van now or two people than me so three people doing it so um he had a lot of a lot of bottles it was uh one third was looked like it was stuffed one third we see here's some stuff here lots of wine bottles and, and the problem is the stuff's too heavy like too heavy what are you gonna do there's no label on it it's worth nothing Easier, worth anything, but it might be. There are juice, so glass juice. I don't know, egg. I don't know. I just don't want to take too much junk. That's worth nothing because then you're hauling garbage. Okay, okay. It's a little bit of metal here. I'm not sure if I can open the back or not. Bottles are gonna fall out. I'm almost done. But I figured I could throw this metal in. The bed frame there and stuff. Brand new shocks are gonna go up. I'm gonna go part of the way only. Oh, here's the other bed frame here. It's actually good night. You got scrap. More bottles. Oh, well, that's a pretty heavy package here. I don't know why it's sitting here. Feel kind of wet. It's the rain so hard. Aluminum track light. Been here for quite a while. Clean the streets up. So it's uh, clean for people, right? So I'm gonna still still cruise a bit. A little area here, but uh, we'll see. Okay, two rims. rims huh? I never thought I'd see any rims. I haven't seen any here on the west side. It's getting full. It's getting full. I just turned my head there and I thought, oh, are they aluminum? They were so shiny, right? Okay, so I gotta take a video of this. His garage is so small, he had to cut the door out and modify it for his GMC. He does never seen that before, but awesome. Cool.
Hey buddy, how you doing? You, you find lots of bottles? Yeah. Yeah, that's good, huh? You don't take these, you don't take wine ones? You don't, you don't take wine? It's so heavy. Yeah, I know it's heavy. So how much could you make? What, what's your best record? Hundred dollars, that's good. But hard work, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, you got quite a bit there. So how much would be here, you think? <laughs> that one? Like, Yeah, so that's maybe like thirty dollar, forty dollar. Thirty dollar. Thirty dollar, huh? Okay, good luck. Be safe, okay? You have a nice day. Thank you. That's cool. You gotta do what it takes. What it takes to uh, get ahead in this world with the rent being so high. But I'll still score. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm calling it quits for tonight because. I don't want to take the bottles. To me, I've got enough. I'm gonna head, about, head out of here and go home, but uh, good for her. She was Filipino. I can recognize the accent. So, all I'm gonna do is gonna clean my hands here. I've been wearing gloves here because everything's so wet. I'm gonna clean my hands, the steering wheel and everything. And I'm gonna give this whole area to her. I'm not gonna bother because to me, Five ten bucks or whatever I get is not the end of the world. And my cutoff was at nine. It's nine thirty almost. So, but it's glad to see someone's you know trying to get ahead in this world, right? You know, it's everything so so difficult and tough. Rents are high, but if you can make you know, she only does this area where she's on the bicycle, right? So that means like I can go in any area. It doesn't matter. So she's. She probably does it twice a week, 